Hey. Hey. Not filmed in a while? No, we haven't actually. We've not filmed today. What have we been doing? We went to Walmart. Walmart. Did some Walmart. shopping for everyone. Spent and ourselves. $280. Between us. <laughs> 150 me, Most 130 Danielle. Can you see the Yep. Um, that was after a line as well. Yeah, we didn't go out till about 11, 11 this morning. And what? then we're going to go watch a movie under the stars for strawberry and kiwi cocktail. Mm. You've got a pomegranate popping candy. Yeah, popping candy in mine as well. A little added bonus. Now we're going to watch the movie Up. Yep, by the pool. And I'm okay. adamant that I want to watch the start of it because that's the best bit. Oh well, not the best bit, but it's a very good bit that I don't want to miss. So we got our plastic cups to go. We're ready to watch it. Did you enjoy movie night? I did. It was very good. It's a good film. No, it's supposed to be movie under the stars, but it's basically so movie at night. Do you want to have a game of table tennis? No. Okay. <laughs> You're going to hear fireworks in one of the parks. Could be, I don't know, it won't be fantastic, it'll be wishes or. Well, it'll be wishes, won't it, really? That's it. It's a lovely lit up bridge. I award you the early badge. Yay! Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know whether you can see me in it. Maybe I was standing up a bit. Yay! Where are we? We're in Epcot. Yay! It's very, very sunny today already. It's only quarter to nine. It's ten to nine. It's going to be a high of 35 degrees today. It's already... It's going to be around 33, 34 for the majority. And then peak at 35 before dipping back down. But it's going to be like 32 at around 12, peaking at 35 around like 4, and then going back down to about 30 at 8 o'clock, and then like 9 or 10 it goes down to like 28 and 27 degrees. And there's the giant golf ball that was see from there, spatial there. Let's go get our bag checked and get in that big long line there to get in the park. I know, it's just so thin. Use it sparingly because it is on. My camera skills are awful. What? I said my camera skills are awful. I'm just trying to walk straight and it's not straight at all. It's really zoomed in. I know, that's fine. I can't seem to get it back. Yeah, it's on times two, like, all the time. I don't know why there is no one, though, because it's on the lowest setting. It says it's on times two. The lowest setting, but I don't know why there is Well, it is, because you can clearly see that it's really zoomed in. The land. Or, we might find out that we're going, so it's just that. Say, Mom. Yes, Molly. How many stitches? I do. Can you hear the seagulls? Mine, mine, mine! Soaring. First ride in Epcot. In the land. Let's go girls, we'll catch 
You ready for it? Do you like snoring? Which road do you think we're going to be in? Road two. See when we get there. To help us maintain these carefully controlled ecosystems, and for your safety, please remain seated in your boat at all times. Welcome to our living laboratory, where scientists from Epcot and the U.S. Department of Agriculture are exploring innovative ways to produce bountiful harvests now and into the future. Many are rich in vitamins and minerals, while others are well adapted to growing in less educated. than ideal conditions. Some, like the water lily, thrive in wet, swampy areas and you probably don't think of fish. But fish farming, or aquaculture, accounts for nearly half of all the seafood consumed globally. Tilapia, bass, and catfish, like the ones you see here, are three of the more popular crops raised by fish farmers. Fishes like this one can play an important role in our efforts to produce bountiful seas in the world. Most of us are only familiar with the handful that make up our everyday diet. The common grains growing here, wheat, maize, sorghum, and millet, plus rice, account for nearly two-thirds of our global food consumption. These plants are definitely on their way up. Innovative growing techniques like these increase yields while more efficiently using resources like water, fertilizer, and pesticides. Some of our best ideas have been inspired by nature, like these fruit and vegetable trees. By growing these ground plants vertically, we can increase yields and better control diseases. Did you enjoy that? Yes. Are we going up? Yeah, you feel very educated? I do, yeah. Tell me one thing you learned from that. That experience of just going on living with the land. One thing. Oh, that all parts of our water lily are edible. Oh, yeah. What did you learn? I learned that cucumbers grow in like tree like plants, which I didn't know. I don't know. No. We already know. I like I don't like cucumbers. Thank you. Where to now? Where to though? I think this is going to be a funny one. Now I've completely lost my train of thought. No, you haven't. It's over here. All aboard! Woo-hoo! Next stop, Imagination! 
Welcome to Club Cool. What have you gone for first? Pineapple Fanta. From Greece. What's that one you've gone for? I hate it. Really? I don't know what it is, it's from the one I've been here, but it's lovely. Spa left, the spa How is it? Not nice? <laughs> Off to meet some characters. That's nice, that's cute. It smells like that. Nice or bad? Good. Uh, I smell it. It smells something, but I won't say it's bad. It smells like a turkey there. Who are you most excited to meet? Well, I don't know who it is. And if you have a choice of all the characters. Okay. Going to meet them. Um, Inside. Oh, it's Inside. Oh, yeah. 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 Excited. <laughs> First time meeting them. I know. <laughs> Didn't meet any of them last year, did we? Well, we went to Princess. Oh, yeah. Magical memories. Flower and Garden Festival, lots of nice flowers everywhere. Did you enjoy meeting the characters, Danielle? We did. It was my favourite part of the holiday so far. <laughs> meeting Minnie. Minnie is my idol. <laughs> Mickey and Goofy. Minnie gave me a kiss. Are you jealous? Did you get jealous? I did a bit, yeah. <laughs> Gonna hear in the face. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. Thank you. Have a great time. Thank you. The World Showcase is so beautiful. So hot. So hot. Too hot. Goddamn. Well, the police and the fireman is too hot. God damn. And that's where Milestone used to be. But they are refurbishing it to be some sort of frozen ride. Which is a shame in many ways. Here we are in Epcot World Showcase. Where there's how many different countries is there here? Would you say? I don't know. Quite a few. Like. Yeah. 11 or something. I'd say over 10. The UK is over there. I think. That's the UK. Oh, no, is that supposed to be. No, that's like France, France, isn't it? That's the UK. No, it's not. Mexico, that's American, I think. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, is that like the White House? Is that the UK? It's like a big American state. Oh. Okay. Maybe not then. We're on our way to Japan to get some sushi. And what country this is? This is, uh, I don't know what this is. What, Africa? Toronto or something? Oh. I want to get my face painted. Oh, look, it's you. Where? There. <laughs> oh. Sweet hairdo as well, isn't it? Yeah, that's why it's like you. He's obviously spent time doing his hair. <laughs> Simba. Made out of flowers, that is. For Epcot's Flower and Garden Festival. Yeah. 
Just carry on. No way. Can your name have a quote? Dopey, yeah. sleepy, grumpy, happy. Bob? Oh, oh. Bob? Doc? Doc. Doc. Yeah, five. Yeah, bashful. Oh, yeah, bashful. Um, is there a happy? Cheeky? <laughs> yeah, there is a happy. Naughty? Naughty. <laughs> Where are we? Let's try. And what are we doing? Building my car. We built yours last time. <laughs> Are you going for the streamline effect? Yeah. Just looks like a normal car. Are you happy with that? Very happy with that. Think you're gonna win? It's not a late win. Definitely your sort of thing. Yes. <laughs> you know what you're gonna pick. Um, Daniel's tea has arrived. What did you go for? Princess breakfast tea, which is South African robust tea with vanilla bean and strawberries. <laughs> There's something quite Strange, but whether she'll like it or not is a different oh, question. It smells amazing. It smells nice. Try it without, then. I don't know. It's a nice. Oh my god. <laughs> the nicest thing I've ever tasted in my life. <laughs> Garden view, mate. I've gone for a water because I'm poorly today. <laughs> so I'll. I'm gonna skip this. Anyway, thank you very much. Yeah. So I've got Cuban Mojo for you with watercress and gorgeous, curry chicken, and a golden beak soaked in white balsamic perrier over goat cheese, traditional egg salad. We've been doing this whole thing, I love it. Right. So we've got Tomo <laughs> cheddar, we've got a sage cherry with lavash crackers, and then a caramelized onion curry. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Tuck in. <laughs> How was your food? What was your favorite bit? Just gonna sip and enjoy your tea now, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Enjoy. Mmm, mixed course. Of your tea. She said they make some of that from scratch. Enjoy. Which is strawberries, strawberries and cream. cream, which she's eating all the cream off of, but yeah. not even many strawberries like to see. Pastries or trifle. That was a bit cool. Pastries from Roddy and trifle I don't like, and this I can just see the cream. <laughs> <laughs> is it nice? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Doesn't look yummy. How would you sum up your experience? I'm definitely going to come back here again.
Yeah. Definitely. It's good then. Say goodbye. Shows the bill. Oh, the front page. Oh, Disney Park, where dreams come true.